Beneath that, they have a comment here where they begin to unpack the layers. So they change directory into that folder and create a new one for them to work in called dot overlay. Then they start to loop in a for loop and they note for every single layer, let's carve out a layer variable that takes the given line uh, that it's working through and using said to replace with some regular expressions. You can see the syntax there, S to substitute, G for global, where it will take the SHA-256 prefix really is what it ends up being and replacing that in between these two forward slashes to nothing. We're replacing them with nothing, otherwise just deleting them, removing that context. So SHA-256 colon goes away. And then they just display that out, echo so we can see it on action, and use tar to now change directory and noting we're working in the overlay folder, extracting each layer with tac tac overwrite. We increment and then we remove that layer so it unravels all of this and unpacks all of these individual layers. Within that code, even, look, let me move all this beneath it. We can make this our focus here. Let's try to zoom in on just this snippet. Do you see a vulnerability? Probably, at least I don't know if you've played some Capture the Flag challenges or you've watched a couple of these videos before. 